Welcome to Always Dolls and thanks for joining us. We are back with more festive food crafts. Today we show how to make this savoury holiday food platter perfect for entertaining. Serve your dolls crackers with cheese cubes, cherries and slices of honeyed ham. Arranged on a faux wooden board in the shape of a Christmas tree. This video is a collab with Dolls and DIYs. Click the link in the description box to watch her sweet treats holiday food platter for even more crafting fun. So, let's get making! Start with a rectangle of foam board or cardboard 12.5 by 8 cm for the platter. We are going to cover it with this sheet of rustic wood scrapbooking paper from Bella Iwood's Papers. Generously cover the foam board with glue, then place your paper over top so the grain runs vertically with the swirl details on the top of the board helping it look more like real wood. Now we have the platter, let's make the savoury food treats. For ham slices we use this thin pink fun foam. Find a circular object, for us it's a plastic shot cup and trace around it for circles. We cut four circles for our platter. Now take a brown marker and lightly run the pen over the edge of the fun foam circle to mimic the look of a honeyed glaze. With a hot glue gun, draw a line in the centre of your circle and fold the fun foam in half. Fold again into quarters using more hot glue to secure it in place. Next, we have a scrap sheet of orange fun foam with self-adhesive on the back. Cut it into strips one centimetre wide. Peel off the release paper and join two strips together. Now cut the strips into one centimetre squares for cheddar cheese cubes. Repeat the process with yellow fun foam for Swiss cheese cubes. Our crackers are made from Fimo Air Light Clay since the microwave variety will speed up the drying process. Click the card top right to learn how Fimo and other common brands of air dry clay perform for doll foods. Mix through a little yellow paint to get a light dough colour. Then roll out a thin sheet. Take a circular cutter or bottle cap and punch out lots of clay circles. To impress ridges into the side of the cracker, roll the edge of your clay along a milk bottle cap. Next, use a toothpick to make the distinctive holes. Then microwave the clay as per package instructions. Give your crackers an all over base coat of yellow ochre mixed with some white paint. Then apply just the yellow ochre to the centre of the cracker. We have this fake holly sprig in our stash and think the styrofoam balls will make cute cherries. With all our foods ready, let's arrange a festive platter. Squeeze a drop of hot glue on the back of your cracker and position it bottom right. Repeat to fill the row. Then add a second layer of crackers placed on an angle. We left one cracker free so the doll can pop it on a plate later during playtime. Put a line of hot glue above the crackers for the Swiss cheese. We packed the cubes tightly together for fullness and height. Note this row is shorter than the crackers. Apply more hot glue for the cherries. Again, this row is shorter than the one below it. Here we have fake sprigs from a plastic houseplant and place them in the mix for colour variation. Above this, we hot glued the cubes of cheddar cheese. After this, we glued down three of our ham slices. And at the very top, we will put our dip. Trim down a small glue stick cap for a simple container. Then partially fill it with cream puffy paint. Stir in a cotton ball to fill up the cap. While the paint is wet, place small clippings off the plastic sprig for garnish. Hot glue the cap to the very top of the board to complete your Christmas tree shaped savoury platter. If you enjoyed this video, we'd love it if you hit that like button, subscribed and turned on the bell. Don't forget to check out Dolls and DIY's awesome sweet treats platter and see you soon for more miniature crafting fun.